Hey, how's it going? Happy 2017. Edward and I are out here and we're looking for that first fish of the year. And let's see if we can make it happen because the water is kind of low right now, but we will see what we get. Yeah, guys, um, conditions aren't prime, but let's see if we can pull out one anyway. We're going to get one, trust me. <laughs> Okay guys, today what I'm basically using, I'm using 20 pound braid, I'm using a one ounce bank weight right there, it's going to the bead, swivel, and 20 pound fluorocarbon leader, about a foot and a half section, one odd circle hook, and a piece of shrimp. And this is on a, a seven foot medium heavy, ugly stick intercoastal rod, happens to be my favorite rod. we get one. Oh, what is up with that? That's what I'm talking about. Nice keeper right there, man. There you guys go. All right, you guys, another little thing we're going to do right now is a 7.6 red bone medium action, pen battle, real, pen battle two actually, 4000 series. And we're using a custom jig head that I make. If you guys want to order some of these from me, please uh, let me know. These are one-out hooks. And what we're going to do is we're going to stick it to the shrimp. Just like so. And we're going to make a cast and see if we can get on another, another snapper. There we go. Oh, this is a nice one right here. A lot nicer. There we go. Look at that. These are all legal fish. We're talking about 10 and a half and up on that jig head. All right, you guys, we got another good one coming up right here. What do you think, about 10? And I'm gonna show you guys this jig because I this jig is totally different from the first one I showed you. This actually comes with a shrimp holder that I custom installed. I'm gonna show you that in a okay, second. Okay, guys, this is a sh uh, the, the jig hook that I make, it's custom. As you can see, it has a little thing right here. It's not meant to be weedless. It's designed only to hold your shrimp. So what you do, same way, stick your shrimp through here. Push it under, right under the barb of that hook, right there. And basically what it does is keep your shrimp from flying off when you're making a cast. It doesn't interfere with the bite, as you guys just saw. Here we go, we got another one. Feels like a small one. Yep, a little dink. I mean, normally this is like a 10 inch snapper, but we don't keep 10 inch, you know, we don't stop on a dime, so we just throw them back. All right, you guys, FWC just rolled up. All right, you guys, check this out. FWC is just leaving right now, and we just hooked up on a little moonfish, a little uh, look down. That neat? That's why you always have to check before you reach out here because you see that spider right there you guys getting bit by that it's gonna be nasty there you go a little barracuda coming up you guys he got it yeah I think he got it yep there he is <laughs> that's crazy you can see them just coming in and picking it up. Here we go. We got a good one right here, you guys. Real good one. Uh. Come on, give him in, bro. Here it comes. Whoa, my God. Check out that snapper, guys. <laughs> oh, Dude, nice. snapper king strikes again right there. There you go, man. Check that out, you guys. That's what we're after. That's Fresh exactly fish of 2017. It's just spit up a bunch of bait. That's a 2017 snapper right there. That's how you start the year, guys. Woo. All right, you guys, we're going to take a little uh, measurement right here. Let's see what we got. Wow, what a beast of a snapper. 
16 and a quarter. 16 and a quarter inch snapper. Look how wide that fish is. That's a beautiful fish. Wow. Awesome. That's an awesome way to start 2017. All right, you guys, we're going to end the day right here. What an awesome way to start 2017. We caught that big 16 inch snapper. We caught a couple of really nice 12, 11 snappers, uh, 11 inch snappers. And let me tell you, we it started off tough, but we still came out on top. And let me tell you, I hope you guys do well too on your first day of fishing out there in 2017. Until next time, have a good one.